We all love great music. I know I do. That's why I've accepted the challenge of launching Rocky Mountain Highway. It's all about original music and live performance. And I said you'd stay forever. People who write their own songs, play their own instruments, and sing with authentic voices. Music is like air, you can't live without it. I listen to it and love it. Without music, this world would be a sad, sad place. So the more music we have, the better. Incredible, the number of people out there that are just dying to find live music somewhere in the Pikes Peak region. There's artists in this community that I love to listen to, that are my favorite artists. Who knows what tomorrow may bring? Rocky Mountain Highway will cultivate emerging local talent by providing musicians with a chance to share the stage with national and international performers. We'll also connect local musicians with audiences in intimate listening rooms throughout the area. I want to be part of a community that's thriving in terms of the arts. Vibrant and beautiful communities prize artistic expression and try to help people make that possible. I think the quality of life in a community, for me anyway, is gauged by how much live performance, how much live art, how much original art is to be found there. When creativity is happening in one area and happening with one group of people, it spreads to other group of pe groups of people and pretty soon you know, you, you're living in a creative place. Every great music community has also great promoters and great, great organizations that help bring music to the scene. Everything from selling tickets to hiring security to uh, closing down roads and and uh, whatever needs to be done to get the music festivals and events going on. Rocky Mountain Highway is a chance for us to develop the live music scene here in Colorado Springs. Our flagship project is Meadowgrass, a three-day music festival held here at the beautiful grounds of La Fere Conference and Retreat Center in Black Forest, Colorado. In the summertime, a thousand people per day come to this music festival. Meadowgrass has grown steadily during the past five years due to the support of dozens of dedicated volunteers and local arts organizations. The activity and energy is amazing, and we have plenty of room to grow. Colorado Springs has great audiences that listen and, and love music, but at Meadowgrass, sometimes you get to play for a thousand or more of them, which is not always the case for Colorado Springs bands. Feels like a family festival and, and an intimate festival, but with the quality of music you find at a more major festival. Music festivals is a general in any town. A lot of people come in and it creates more awareness of who this community and who this town is. The activity booths we set up, whether it be the giant soap bubbles or a how to juggle workshop, those are very much oriented towards children. But we find that in a festival situation like at Meadowgrass, the parents are right there as well. And so you have this great intergenerational thing going on with everybody having a chance to play. Kids covered in paint, dancing around, singing. Everybody who's still standing at the end of the evening decamps down to the fire pit area of Meadowgrass. Everybody sits around, tells stories, listens to music in an informal setting. That's my favorite part of it. Some of the musicians have come by, have played with us, have taken classes with us. So it's a really fabulous experience to, if nothing else, warm your body up before you dance all day long. I remember Joe Pug was just so impressed talking about, you know, this is such a great festival. And I was very proud that we had, as a community, come together to, you know, really support in such a beautiful setting uh, and a uniquely Colorado setting to really support awesome live music. And it's a great venue for us because we get to play for a larger audience um, and a, on a big stage with an amazing sound system. These are things we don't get to do on a regular basis. And at Meadowgrass, uh, the beautiful thing that you've done with that, by including local musicians, is given us a chance to play under the stars. It doesn't get much better than that. I think what's needed here in the Pikes Peak region is the ability to, to take these wonderful ideas, to take an idea of a meadow grass or a mountain of the sun, and make it something that's sustainable. By developing partnerships with local businesses and charitable foundations, we can keep Meadowgrass and our other events sustainable for the long term. Partnering with Meadowgrass last year, I think, opened up a lot of opportunities for both of us. We would certainly like to 
to collaborate, to work with Rocky Mountain Highway down the road because I think there's a wonderful opportunity for, for bringing original music and original theater together. It's important to us as a company that we support the community, the music that happens here. You know, now that we're at Ivy Wallet, I think it's an awesome opportunity to, again, bring local music into the community. When people start to collaborate and they start to work with each other and they start to share resources and ideas, then there's some audience sharing and that there are people, there's basically this really nice cross-pollination of efforts that happens. We're hard at work developing plans for other events. We're collaborating with the Pikes Peak Community Foundation to revision the Mountain of the Sun Music Festival. I've had the honor and privilege of brainstorming with local musicians, audiophiles, and community dreamers about how best to raise awareness about the exceptional music scene here in Colorado Springs. I believe that together, we can build on the success of Meadowgrass to help our local original artists reach their full potential, both artistically and financially. This is a huge town. There's no reason why every show shouldn't be selling out. There's magic that happens uh, when things are live. We have big plans, but we need help from music lovers like you. Whether you can give $5 or $5,000, your generous contribution will help establish the foundation we need to achieve our goals. Please join with us to ensure that original music and live performance thrive in the Pikes Peak region, now and forever. What we're trying to do is, is uh, help the music scene in the Pikes Peak region take off. I mean, it's Colorado, you've got such beauty here, how could you not be inspired? We should take advantage of that to be the best artistic community as well as all the other things that we do so well here. So if you have really great musicians that are coming out of this town, why not invest in them to have to give them the chance to be, to be great at what they do? It's not just a bunch of bands that wish they could be in Denver. We like it here and we're Colorado Springs fans and, and that's fine. Some of us are pretty good. It takes so many hours to become a, a truly great musician. Uh, and it only takes a few minutes for the rest of us to create an investment in, in their future that will bring it back tenfold to our community. It's moving in a really exciting direction. It's going down here. Huge.